researching Sarah Bernhardt for this tour, I found some incredibly interesting facts about the life she led. I could talk about how she joined the Paris Conservatory, or Conservatoire de Paris, the most revered acting company in Paris, at the ripe young age of 18. How she was awarded the French Medal of Honor for her screenplays, and later awarded for her work as an actress, or even how she toured America twice in her lifetime to act in stages across the nation. But instead, I'd like to share a story in particular that especially connected with me. In 1863, Sarah invited her younger sister Regina to accompany her to a party held by her acting company. However, during the party, her sister accidentally stepped on the leading actress's dress, a woman named Madame Natalie. When Regina tried to apologize, the older actress pushed her off, causing Sarah's sister to stumble and fall, cutting her forehead. Sarah got so mad at the actress that they started arguing, leading Sarah to smack the other woman in the face. When the theater director asked Sarah to apologize, she refused to do so until Madame Natalie apologized to her sister, but the actress also refused, further demanding that Sarah be dropped from her upcoming role until she apologized. Even though Sarah had the leading role and could have easily kept it, she walked out of the company instead. As an older sister myself, I can completely sympathize with her actions. In any scenario, I would defend my sister if she were ever attacked like that. Sarah's character is incredibly respectable because she continuously acted upon her beliefs throughout her life. Even though Sarah later achieved great success in her career as an actress, the setback of leaving such an influential company at such a young age must have been a challenge for her. Despite this, Sarah stood up for her sister and for what she thought was right. Her ultimate success teaching us that you should always stand up for your morals no matter what.